having data that's not just reactive, not just predictive, but actually prescriptive can lead to improvements in driver behavior and to lower operating costs. Well, I think what our clients are telling us now is, is more um, around data. It's more around not just being predictive, but being prescriptive. I think there's a lot of information that's available to people, and what they don't want is they don't want to just receive all this information and have to kind of hunt and peck through and, and try to find opportunities. They're looking for somebody who can take all this disparate data, bring it together, aggregate it, and, and kind of tell the story for them. Um, they're looking for, for somebody who can um, you know, do the analysis, um, use different pieces of data that they can provide or that we can provide to them, and, um, and just help in overall um, enhancing their business. So when you look at data, some of the things that they're concerned with are, are just, um, when you take one piece of data, it may tell one story, but when you can take different pieces of data and put it together, it tells a much different story. So an example of that would be um, enhancing a lot of the, um, the reporting we've done with both our fuel data and our telematics data. So when you start to put those two pieces of data together, you start to look at things like changing driver behavior. Um, helping to lower your operating costs, helping to boost productivity. So it's, it's getting into the mind of that driver and again being prescriptive and, and not just being reactive to what the driver did but trying to find out where the vehicle's been going um, based on fueling patterns where the vehicle should be and then putting together a recommendation for that fleet to, to ultimately enhance the driver experience.